Alright, gonna be watching Doctor Who Series 11, Episode 5. Let's get on with it. Chibnall's doing a lot of these. I'm gonna assume he's doing the whole season. We're never gonna find one! No, hold on! I found something! I'm sorry. Nobody move. What is it? Sonic Mine. I can't find the med tags. <sighs> Your body will take a moment to catch up. Can you point Oh, it's that guy. You? We're in hospital. And you're the last one up. Told you. Is the guy from Ted Lasso? Rory, I think that's his name. The Robo Dread has notified us as they were pulling you from the debris. You've I had no idea it was in Doctor Who. Saranga's actually had to take you. Saranga? No, that name. Oh. Hey, come back. Which way is out? Looking for the exit. General Cicero, you're mentioned in the Book of Celebrants. This is my brother Durkas and my consort Ronan. And who are you? I'm the Doctor. I've heard that name. Isn't there a whole chapter about you? Lovely chatting must be off. I'd say it was more of a volume than a chapter. <laughs> Just saying. So you know. Hi. Oh, sorry. Looking for the exit. Hello. What are you in for? Pregnant. <laughs> Why? What's that, nine months? No, last week. Last week? Are you a gift tag? Wow. What do you mean, go? We have been trying to tell you. Yes, you have. Vibrations. This isn't a hospital. It's a ship. Bad liar must be difficult in your job. Hey, I'm an excellent liar. Bad liar. If this was Ted Lasso, he would have shouted at her literally like five minutes after seeing her. <laughs> this is completely opposite to how he is in Ted Lasso. My job is to keep all of you safe. You're stopping me from doing that. You're right. Sorry. We will get you back safe. Nothing to worry about. So what's that? Not sure. I don't know your name. I'm the doctor. Are you kidding? Sometimes. Hmm. But not right now. You must supply them without delay. Let's get them then. I think that's staff only. Deny everything or uh, ask you to turn a blind eye. I see your problem. Yeah. Generally, <laughs> truth is... I was trying to hack into my sister's medical records. Oh, well, she's lying to me. Oh, what's wrong with that? The pot, side life pot. It's gone. It's here. Do not engage. Rookie mistake. It's jettisoning the pod. And I'm inside. Mably. I'm sorry, Mably. He tricked me. Can't get back. What? You can do this, Mably. You're good enough. I believe in you. I always have. What a weird scene. <laughs> like it was done very weirdly. It tricked me. What the fuck are you on about? <laughs> I think there may have been an incident. If I sink my ocular recorders... Sink the old ocular recorders, obviously. All Saranga <laughs> medics... I knew you were up to something. Um, we're gonna need you to... Oh, put your hand there. Nah, you're all right. Oh, come on, please. <laughs> he likes you guys. That's how it is. Not where we come from. How's that work? <laughs> <laughs> That's so weird to you're look at. Me, a grown up person, I couldn't do that. No, he really couldn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you miss him. He's the same age as my dad must have been when he had me. I wouldn't be able to cope having a kid now. When was the last time you saw your dad? A year ago. Got angry with him. Yeah, the acting's shit. <laughs> you can Don't feel know. it. I mean, Even never said that before. I've never, I've Even never talked about the acting before in anything. You can feel it. It's just weird. Yaz is fine. This guy, you can tell. It's just, <laughs> it might just be his That's voice. He's saying he's talking in a lower voice. How old were you? Thirteen. Yeah, it feels like I'm watching a student short film. So like, <laughs> people always said that I look like that. Why am I even talking about this? Yeah, it feels like students trying to act in their college short film or some shit. I'm the doctor. Doctor of medicine, science, engineering. War. But the first thing it did was kill Astos. That must be what it wants to do to all of us. They destroy the ship. We can't keep doing that. It's 25 minutes in. I've lost interest, but there's something that's like keeping me going. I, I don't know what it is. There's something good about it. And I don't know what it is because it's keeping me watching. But I really, I lost interest like 10 minutes ago. Would you two be my doulas? Birth partners? If I need some men with me. <laughs> I did a bit on antimatter at school. Never quite understood it. Not an issue either. Me with yeah, every yeah, subject we ever did. I really want to skip this one, but like, I don't want to miss anything. Because there are stuff about it that I like. What are you doing? Why would you be using adrenaline blockers for cotton fever? Is it pilot's heart? You need to be honest with me. I cannot have pilot's heart. Does Dirkus know? He already has. Dirkus. We don't have time now. Breathe deep, cockle. I am breathing. Oh, it's really <laughs> The baby's ready to come out. Oh, God. Oh. Where does it even come out from? Do they cut him open? Get it as far away from the drivers as I can. This isn't going to 
work. Trust your engineer. I'm well enough. Now promise me that's true. I can see the course. Still got it, boy. I've missed this so much. Take us in safely, General. What will we do with the Pating when we get to Rhesus One? I didn't care about the sibling story thing in this episode. But now I, I think it's kind of nice. What the hell? What? I've never been less relaxed in all my life. I do not want to do this. <laughs> We're all here for you, aren't we? Oh, yeah, I've seen every episode of Call the Midwife. Every episode? Yeah, it's bang on. See, whilst you've been mucking around on YouTube, I've been learning useful <laughs> life skills. I think so I know I why I haven't clicked off forward. yet. It's because oh, the, the stuff with the characters is fun to watch. They can't open a bloke's stomach. They have that on Call the Midwife. He's looked away at squeamish bits. <laughs> that would be me. I do not want this baby. You can do this. We'll be lucky to have a good man like you, as is that. Wow. <laughs> I feel bad for it. The episode was Sorry. fun by the end. I didn't tell you I was ill. Plenty of things I never told you. Like I love you. I love you too, bro. There's the baby. He's fine. You just have to be there. Come on, Professor Squeamish. No. Cool. Her heart couldn't take it. She gave me control. Bringing her in safe. I did. It's a baby. I'm your dad. Nice one, Jos. If your nan could see us now. You'd be laughing herself crazy. Yeah. <laughs> no. Damn. Have you got a name for the baby? In honor of you both, avocado. <laughs> You what? Avocado. Yeah. Well, after the ancient Earth hero. It's not a hero. I thought he was going to say you'd call him after us. Graham <laughs> Lamb. No. He'd be laughing. <laughs> oh, cheers. If you're naming him, does that mean you're going to keep him? I thought I'd give being a dad a try. Cool. I'm going to make mistakes, aren't I? I'll just keep going. Nice. What happens to you now? I've come well, this character was so useless. <laughs> Why was he here? I completely forgot he existed until now. Were you in camp for her? It would be my honor. Can we join you? Please. May the saints of all the stars and constellations bring, bring you hope. Cool. On this voyage and the next journey still to come. Cool. Alright, so see, this is why I don't like to skip stuff, even if it does end up being shit. Because I, I like this one, I liked it by the end. It doesn't change the fact that the whole middle section was dead. But I, by the end, I thought it was really nice. I thought the whole pregnancy stuff was really important to not only just Ryan and this whole dad thing, but also between him and Graham. And we are, we are slowly seeing it build and build. And I'm happy it's not like in your face. I feel like... By the time it properly develops, we'll get something between them. Um, but like, you, you, every episode you see it slowly build and build and build. Um, and I really like that. The stuff with the siblings, I uh, didn't care for it at first. It felt a bit weird. But by the end, I uh, actually really liked it. It was nice to see. Um, I liked the bit at the end where they were all, they were saying, I don't know, was it a prayer? A space prayer together? That was really nice. Overall, by the end, it was actually pretty cool. I, I would, I'd have to say it's mid overall. If I'm thinking about the story overall, it's mid. But if I had to choose good or bad, I'd say it was a good episode. Yeah, there's not much else to really say about it, to be honest. It was, uh, by the end, I, I had a good time. I was happy by the end of the episode, so you can't, re I can't really say it was a bad episode if that's how I felt by the end. Uh, so yeah, can't wait to watch more. <laughs>